I challenged a thousand people to Photoshop this image. An idea that's completely original and I didn't steal from small time streamer Ludwig. Uh, so don't even look into that. Those are fake allegations, you know, all that kind of stuff. Hold on, let me, sorry. Let me get on y'all's level, okay? Sorry, tall guy problems over here. Uh, let's bring up the subreddit, shall we, guys? It is a subreddit day, guys. Coffeezilla underscore GG. That's coffeezilla underscore GG. Join the small club. Honestly, it's a small club of privileged people right now who photoshopped this image. So we're going to see what you guys have. Highest voted meme at the end of this wins platinum award and a feature in next Saturday's video. I will also be selecting my personal favorite to also receive platinum, okay? If it's terrible, if it's good, whatever, anything that makes me laugh. And then finally, stay to the end because I'm going to be announcing next week's challenge. So if you want to win imaginary internet points that don't matter to anyone else, but about a thousand people who know this thing exists, hey, <laughs> you've come to the right place. Welcome to the subreddit, guys. Uh, honestly, we're going pretty fast. A thousand members already. We need to bump those numbers up. 10,000 would be nice. Uh, but, you know, we're growing. We just started last week, okay? Give me, cut, cut me some slack. So, let's get into it. First meme. Hey. <laughs> what? what is this? Coffeezilla after missing an upload. Hey, man. No, this is not gonna happen, guys. <laughs> this is never gonna happen. I honestly... I saw Always Marco, I don't know if you guys saw this guy, uh, a friend of mine, he recently shaved his head, and it's not a good look. I realized, I joined his stream, and I realized immediately, this cannot happen to me. So we are not going to be missing an upload, daily YouTuber, all the way through January, maybe February, we'll see. But not going to happen. So I gave that gold, yes, because I'm a, I'm, I'm a giving man. Uh, next meme. By the way, some of these memes, if it doesn't have the photoshopped image in it, it's technically not up for competition. But I thought we'd just look at the memes of the subreddit anyways, okay? The story I tell. <laughs> what actually happened? <laughs> Dan Pena's like stabbing a teddy bear. Then he's on Joe Rogan the next day being like, Joe, it was eight feet tall and it was about to kill me until I killed it. Okay. I guess that's a chuckle. I'll upvote that. Why not? You know? A lot of memes that are not part of the competition. This is the first thing actually I learned about my audience. Y'all don't listen. That's number one. <laughs> is that these are ir irrelevant memes. But they're pretty good, honestly. Spoken like a true laptop lifestyle millionaire. A 30-year Harvard education. <laughs> Whoa. This is worthless. <laughs> that's what Caleb Maddox believes. That's what a lot of these guys believe. They're like, 30 years at Harvard? It's a waste of time. It's, why would you even do that? I mean, it reminds me of this stuff, dude. It's like, it's not just Caleb Maddox who's pushing this whack idea. The most obsolete idea is go to school, get a job, work hard, save money. <laughs> Robert Kiyosaki, dude. Terrible idea. Don't listen to that guy. The most obsolete idea is to get a job, guys. Hey, you don't need a job. You can shill gold and sell get rich advice like Robert Kiyosaki, guys. S sell for MLMs. Do that, guys. Try that on for size. Greatest opportunity of our era. So, uh, gave that gold, and I'll go ahead and give that an up toke. All right. Next meme. Business. Okay, again, not relevant to the competition, but okay. That's fine. Business gurus be like having a <laughs> stable nine to five job. Than Robert Kiyosaki hustling 24 7 and not actually making money. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll upload it, give it gold. Uh, see, I'm a generous, you know, dictator over here in the CoffeeZilla GG subreddit. You gotta join guys, because I'm very nice to people. Next meme, top tips, not relevant. Uh, many of the youngsters asked me how I became so successful. So here are my top tips. Buy a big house to impress investment bankers. Befriend investment bankers. Get investment bankers drunk. Learn inside information off drunk bankers. Trade off inside information. Very simple. Good, good advice, actually. Nah, first time we've had pretty good advice on this subreddit so far. The real pandemic at home DIY haircuts. <laughs> nice. Okay, you get gold for that. Me, mom, can I get a Harvard education? <laughs> mom, you can have a Harvard education at home. The Harvard education at home. <laughs> It's kind of true, isn't it, man? 
Uh, this is the new, they're pitching themselves, Harvard educated. It's like, these guys are snake oil salesmen. This is not even close. <laughs> it's not even close. This is like how Amish says he, he went to Harvard. X, Harvard X. <laughs> Not the same thing, guys. Not the same. Long time no see. Friend I haven't seen in years. Me. Pyramid scheme. Yeah, uh, this kind of hits close to home. If you ever get a text or Facebook messenger, it's usually Facebook messenger, out of the blue, don't respond from someone you haven't seen. They're like, hey, man, so nice to see you. Da da da. Long time no see. Got a crazy business opportunity. Yeah, I really want to talk to you about it. Got time for coffee? No. You only got time for CoffeeZilla. Next meme. Okay, finally, someone uses a picture of me, but it's the wrong picture of me. You had photo, you had green screen material, and instead, you, <laughs> you, you took a circle of me. I don't know what this kind of Photoshop is, but anyway, okay, first Photoshop, whatever. When Steven said get free gold from posting on his Reddit, he meant it's the greatest opportunity of our era. True, guys, true. Actually, I didn't mean that anyone who joined would get free gold, but that's how everybody interpreted it. I meant everybody who was on the Reddit at the time of me putting up that video got free gold, but everyone came looking for free gold, so I ended up uh, scamming you. I don't, know, I don't know what else to say. I tried to give a lot of free gold away, but nonetheless, if you actually go to my subreddit right now, the number one uh, top, top rated thing is... Impeach coffee. When you post a meme on CoffeeZilla subreddit three days ago and didn't get the gold that was promised. I didn't promise gold away to everybody. I don't think I did. I was trying to say that everyone who was on the subreddit pre the announcement got free gold and then it was going to become harder to get over time. But I, okay, I scammed you guys. What can I say? Everyone came to the, to the subreddit like uh, the seagulls from Finding Nemo. Boomer reference. My, 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 if you have three people in your downline, and if those three people also get three people, they get gold. And if your three friends do that, you get platinum. That's an announcement. Hey, we're a pyramid scheme now. I think it'd be really funny. So get three friends in. If you can prove it, and you can prove that those three friends got three friends, you get platinum. That's it. That's it. That's how it's done. Uh, announcing it right now. And don't worry, you won't get scammed. Remember how I did the last giveaway? So don't worry about that. I never scammed anybody in my life. Oh, they actually used the thing. They used the green screen. I didn't even notice. 25 upvotes. Okay. Uh, did that beat the other guy? No. The guy who actually did the thing. <sighs> okay. All right. Oh, here we go. Coffeezilla got a pee. This is what I'm talking about. Yes. Yes. They did the thing. Coffeezilla got a PhD in fake gurus. They used the green screen. Beautiful. Mwah. Mwah. I love it. Dreams PhD Harvard Astrophysicist. <laughs> yeah, guys. I, I have an announcement to make. I'm the secret expert astrophysicist he was talking about. I'm an expert in statistics. And he didn't cheat, guys. He didn't cheat. Uh, Yeah, nice. Clever used, uh, you know, used a callback. Is that the top voted one right now? Let's find out. I think that's the highest upvoted one so far. 36 upvotes. All right. Way to go. You're on your way to platinum, sir. Uh, you, whatever. I don't know what that username is. Next meme, guys. It was hard to find a picture of Dan Pena smiling. <laughs> Coming to the sub, sub to support your favorite YouTuber. Coming on the sub to receive a gold award. <laughs> Wow, he actually is smiling. I think that is the first time I've seen Dan Pena smile. You know, a lot of Dan Pena memes. He's a very memeable guy. I've got to give it to him. He's one of the most memeable gurus for sure. And I did give you gold. Okay, notice that. I'm not a con man. I came through on my promise. Okay. Came here for the Reddit gold. That's it. And as you can see, not a con man. I gave you Reddit gold. Okay. Because right now people are demanding that I, I scammed everybody. Dude, I seriously gave gold to as many people as I could. But you guys, too many of you posted. What could I say? 
I demand coffee to be <laughs> investigated by himself on his own channel for not giving me the gold on the meme I posted three days ago. Where's my gold, Sifu? Scammer of the year time. It's actually pretty good. I just noticed he used the thing. Five upvotes. Mm, too bad, buddy. Not gonna get gold this time. Now, you know what? Actually, since you actually did the thing, hey, I'm gonna give you gold. Boom. How dare you slander this great man? True. Also, gold. Thank you for defending my honor. Appreciate it, bud. Appreciate you defending my honor there. Gold. A tough choice. What do you choose? Joining Harvard? Joining maximum wage. <laughs> I can't decide, guys. What do you think we should do? Entrepreneur. <laughs> Join my team for $20 and be your own boss, too. Everybody on Instagram with like Forex in their bio or entrepreneur in their bio, they don't own what they say they own. Please, guys, don't fall for this stuff. There's gold and then there's maximum gold. Real gold. Coffeezilla. Oh, very good. Well, hey, sir, you've got real gold right there. Fool's gold. Maximum comedy gold. Worth more than 30 years at Harvard. Oh. Yeah, that's, uh, that's going to be a meme forever, I feel like. I have a feeling this is going to turn into people making fun of me. Wheeze for being a hobbit and for having a large head. IDK, Coffeezilla 2021. Therapist. Coffeezilla with glasses isn't real. He can't hurt you. Coffeezilla with glasses. Hey! Hey, man. You don't need to stretch out my head. That's rude. That's already offensive. This is fake news, guys. Don't believe this. I don't know where you got this image, but uh, I do not wear glasses. Perfect 2020 vision, and don't let anyone tell you guys otherwise, please. Coffeezilla exposing upcoming fake gurus for the first time. OG fake gurus. First time. Uh, yeah, man. Sometimes I do look at these, like, new guys coming up, and I'm like... How do you, do you not see where this leads? It's a bad, it's a bad dis life decision. Not because of me, but just look at the future of like, do you want to be Ty Lopez when you grow up? Who who grows up and be, is like, hey, I want to be like Dan Locke. I don't, I don't know. I don't know who looks up to these guys. Coffeezilla taking a dump on his king size toilet. $10 million studio stuff. <laughs> what is this? What is this Photoshop? You couldn't crop it in to make it like seem like I... Just didn't have no feet, you wouldn't understand. <laughs> and then, by the way, okay, that was all fine, fun, and games, but then the comments isn't that a normal sized toilet with a hobbit on it? You're right, I need to slap whoever wrote the title for spreading fake news. What is this? Okay, let me say something, guys. I'm sorry, I gotta address this right now, okay? This is, this is downright offensive. I'm gonna put this to bed once and for all. This has all been fake news this whole time. The truth is, guys, I'm not that short, okay? Um, I'm actually pretty tall. My doctor measured me the other day. He said I'm one Rogan tall, maybe even two. Like, I'm like one to two Rogans tall. And um, yeah, I don't wanna be made fun of for it anymore. I know the Hobbit meme was funny, but uh, it's not funny anymore, okay? I'm out here trying to fight the fake gurus and y'all are fighting, y'all are bullying me and I don't appreciate that. All right guys, that about does it. The highest rated meme that used the challenge was this one. Coffee's all got a PhD in fake gurus, dreams, PhD, Harvard astrophysicist. Congratulations. You're the first person to get platinum on this subreddit and uh, yeah, hats off to you, sir. Congratulations, it's a special day, okay? Gold and platinum. That's a it's a it's a big big honor. Okay, the next person, I guess, runner up. I would have to say this one. Coffeezilla, after missing an upload, sir, you also get platinum. Thanks for playing. This is why you always have to just try because you never know if you're gonna what you're gonna win. Okay, here on Coffeezilla, easy to get gold and platinum, especially if you recruit through friends. So guys, thanks for playing. Thanks for joining. I uh, hope you enjoyed it, you know. I, I guess back in my day, I had Saturday morning cartoons. You guys have lazy Saturdays, lazy red Saturdays. Good trade-off, I would say. Uh, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. But before you go, we got a new challenge for the subreddit this week, guys. It's not a meme. Now we're getting our musical talents engaged. All you have to do is create the new lazy Saturday theme song, guys. The highest upvoted theme song. 
uh, and it has to be uh, safe for work, you know, fun, good for the video. But it will become our theme song and we'll also get platinum. So submit your theme songs in the subreddit, guys. We'll have a little uh, form for it or whatever. Go ahead, sign up. Who knows? You could win. You could win gold. You could win platinum. And better yet, you could win the love and support of a bunch of internet strangers. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.